What's up, everyone? Welcome back to Rob's Gaming Table. Today on the table, Rob, Melanie, Ashley, and Nick are playing the Rise of Penders campaign for Scythe. This is episode four. If you haven't already watched, uh, we've done episodes one through three on the channel uh, if you're watching this in the future. Otherwise, if you're live streaming with us on New Year's Day, this is our fourth game in a row. We have been playing for like nine hours and we're still going. Uh, so we might be a little loopy here in this final game. If we mess up anything huge, leave it in the comments below or let us know in the live chat. Thank you to everyone who's been hanging out with, with us here on New Year's Day. Uh, helping us with the rules, helping us through this game, having a fun time, not spoiling anything. We appreciate that. Uh, but definitely, spoiler warning, if you haven't played The Rise of Fenris up to this point, we might be spoiling a little bit of story and might be opening some boxes, punch boards, stuff that's hidden. We are new to this. So do not spoil anything for us if you're watching live. Uh, and we're not tournament level site players, so we do some inefficient stuff. But we do appreciate S. Chiang, especially in the chat, who's been dropping in some good strategy tips for us. If you're watching along this in the future, there might be, you can, if you're watching the live stream, you can turn on like the previous chat and you'll see some of the stuff he's been saying, but it's good, good tips. We appreciate it. Thank you to all our Patreon backers for supporting us on the channel and helping us grow and all that business. If you'd like to donate, uh, you can do so by clicking the link in the description below. And if you don't want to miss us doing the live streams in the future, Click that bell notification after you subscribe. Alrighty then. Episode 4. Uh, so, story summary. A new breed of rabble rouses calling them... A new breed of rabble rousers calling themselves Fenris. Finally, Fenris has shown up. <laughs> has emerged. They are menacing the people of Europa. And it is irritating the governments who have decided it is time to put these agents in their place. Set up the game as usual, which we have done. We divvied out our mats uh, randomly. The Vesna player... So if you missed last episode or missed the live stream earlier and you're just joining us, we opened one of the new boxes and got a whole new light blue, teal faction, whatever color it is over there. Vesna has some special rules. She gets... Ashley is playing as Vesna, who will replace the Rusviet faction in our playthrough. So it's starting on the Rusviet starting locations. She has this cool ability where she gets three factory cards to start that were from the spare factory cards that were not set up here. There's five here, right? So they're not from the five that are here for all to choose from. Anytime she puts a pawn on one of those factory tokens, she can take the top, bottom, both or none abilities on it. But when she does, that card disappears after she's done resolving it, goes out of the game, and you can get one total from the factory to add to that pile, but that one still has the same stipulation. Once you use it once, boom, it's gone. So you get like cool four factory cards mm -hmm. to basically use per game, but they're only one time use each. Um, she also has some special abilities if you want to tell us what you picked for your two random abilities we did it off camera where she drew six mech mods out of her pile of mech mods to fill in her two blank mech mods so they can change every game out of 18 i think random ones uh what did you pick what do they do uh so the first one is people's army in combat where you have at least one worker you may play one additional combat card You've heard of that before <laughs> i love that one and before combat so artillery before combat, combat, if you pay one power, your opponent gets minus two power. Wow. Fighty, fighty. I like it. All right. Uh, and anything else special for you? Your, your faction ability is the factory card thing, right? On yes. this board there? Yes. Uh, anything else special with Vesna? Let's just double check to make sure. Cards. Sorry, Sorry, you one. only get one. Oh, I don't know why. Cheater, my cheater, Sam. I, do you want me to shuffle them? Or? Just, well, just a quick Yeah, whatever. just a quick toss it around, whatever. Who cares? Oh, I looked here at money. Oh. oh sure. I don't know. Money? Oh, interesting. interesting. <laughs> Cheater, That's how I got 13 cards last time. So this is how Vesna wins. All right. <laughs> She's shady. Okay. Okay. So other Vesna rules. Uh, we don't need to set her up. We already did all that. Faction ability we talked about. River walk and speed are her other abilities. So her river walk, you can move your character and mechs. Nick, you got something to... No, you're looking at the wrong thing. No, no, that's later when she puts her recruit. Yeah, she he has a problem with this enlisting, man. He's all over the place. Uh, all right, so River Walk. You may, choose, you may move your character in mechs across rivers to and from adjacent territory containing any player structure. That's your default River Walk. Did you cover up any of those other two? No. You're good to keep them? I had okay. all combat things. So she but... has the option when she does take the six mech mods from a random 18, she could take three or four of them to cover up her existing speed, which is the same most, most factions have. Or she can cover up her river walk, which allows her to move uh, from any adjacent territory to uh, a play one containing any player's structure. Move a character mechs across rivers to and from. Okay. So if we build structures across the rivers from where she's starting, anywhere along here, or here I guess, all along there, she can kind of just come out from there easy peasy with her so river walk. So if we have a guy on there though. 
the yeah she could still gets, come there because that guy gets scared yep yep home, it would run home she yep. Loses yep. Popularity. yep 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 okay. all the same stuff applies it's just it's cool she's hoping other people will build structures there she can get out other ways by building the mine and then build a structure and that helps her out too right but keep that in mind if we don't build stuff for her there that uh, could keep her more locked in and make it harder for her to get out interesting uh all right and we're not using any airships we're not playing with the the wind gamut stuff uh so the vesna player uses the same home base we talked about that keeps all her stuff from her log we randomize player mats you may play this episode with the airships and or the doomsday clock, clock or backup plan resolution tiles from the wind gamut we talked about this before the episode we're not going to use them not going to use any of the airships and stuff we have limited time to play this last episode we've been playing all day so we're going to try to play this one a little quicker and we just think that'll delay the game more uh, gain all bonuses earned under setup bonuses on your campaign log. Which I think we've done. So Unless did you I didn't any? buy any. Oh, the setup bonuses are these. I'm yeah. going to buy you one, which I didn't do. Oh, now we're going to buy the oh, perks. Oh, no, setup bonus is different than the perks. Yes. Yeah. Oh, yes, yes. But you do get to do that, right? It'll tell us, uh -huh. I think, always. Uh -huh. uh, gain all bonuses. Yeah, okay. Open. Uh, let me just read it. Oh, yeah, that's later. Okay, it's yeah. later. Sorry. Open box B. <gasps> Oh, Ooh, it's a good thing you guys stay oh, to get another box. Good. Then they're going to want to stay again because yep. it's going to be so good. It's like crack. <laughs> it's like crack. Oh, this oh, is a little, look at that guy. cutie box. Oh, it's, it's so be, cute. It's going to be something that messes with look us. Look at this little, I'm going to fit. try to fit the whole game in this box after when we're done. <laughs> All right. Uh, oops, hold on. Open box B and place one Fendrus agent, wooden worker meeples, eight total, on each tunnel and two on the factory. <gasps> Oh. So are these the glowing eyes dudes that we've heard about? No, oh, they're my that's... alliance people, maybe. Uh, no. I'm that's creating a cool, an alliance. That's a cool orange. Look that at is that. Cool. That is cool. That is it's cool. like a coral right. almost. While you're doing that, Pablo's asking, how much do you recommend Gloomhaven? And hello from Spain. <laughs> Pablo, how's it going? Uh, well, we played Gloomhaven a ton on the channel, as you know. We've beaten the game. We played some extra scenarios. We played some solo Gloomhaven stuff. We still haven't played Forgotten Circles. We've seen most of the classes. Haven't even opened some of them. But we played it two, three player, solo. Love it. Love Gloomhaven. Totally worth the money. You get so much game out of it. But you have to like the systems in the game. You have to like the whole card mechanic system and how each scenario is a puzzle. But the one downside is like you'll play the missions over and over again. It kind of feels like you're playing a little bit of the same over and over again. And it's good if you can have a group that's willing to play hundreds of hours with you. Uh, because then you'll get to experience the story together. But that's great jump in and jump out mechanics. So you can totally play like Mel and I did with, with your wife or spouse or friend who comes over all the time. And then if you have buddies come over and want to teach them, they can start up new characters, play with you a couple scenarios, leave, come back months later, jump in the scenario, and just explain what's going on, and they can keep playing. It's great. But yeah, definitely worth Gloomhaven. Man, it's the number one game on Board Game Geek of all time for a reason. Uh, it's great. And now you've got to start playing it now so that you can have it finished when Frosthaven comes out in early 2021, the next big box, 100 hours, whatever, expansion, standalone expansion. So you could skip regular Gloomhaven and just play Frosthaven, but you still have a year to play Gloomhaven, so I would go get it. Factory. Thank you. And then, did you ever answer what game you're looking forward to in 2020? Yeah, I gave some yeah. some labs, but yeah, I don't even know. I'm, eh, like, who knows? I, there's so many games I don't even know that are coming that will just be announced at like Gen Con or before Gen Con, so it's hard to say. Did it take two at the factory? Yeah, two. Yes. yes. Okay. Yeah, so they're all gone. Eight total, we right? Oh, we have to do with the these box, men, right? Maybe we'll... Yeah, it's a cute little box. Yeah, we'll use it again. We should have known the meeple color. It's the color on the outside. Mm -hmm. Oh, I should have known. All right. What happens with them? Is there we're something gonna else? Yeah, uh, we're going to find out. Just follow the instructions. If you have any infrastructure mods, these may not have been unlocked. Place them face up near your play area. If you have any mech mods, these may not have been unlocked yet. You may place them in your area. So we have some of those. We'll, we'll talk about them as we do them in the play. Uh, or if you've seen them in the past episodes, you'll know what we picked and what we've used. Uh, but you'll see what we flipped soon. Um, and then if desired, deduct 15 from your wealth to purchase a perk to use in the game, which I am going to do. So... 15, that's 54, 49. Oh, no. I'm going to do it, but I don't yet know which. Yeah, same. I'm going to take an extra worker. That's a good one. I'll just grab... Uh, let me do two combat cards. I'm so sorry. Do I just take my worker from here and put it Yes. And just put somewhere? it in a spot where you have a worker. Has to be where you have a worker. Okay, I'm going to take two resources. And what do you want? Sorry, Rob? Two, uh, combat, two combat cards. Two combat cards, please. Two resources. I will take two oil. 
Okay. okay. So we're getting our. Uh, are you doing anything? Yeah, I'm gonna Remember, do two you, hearts. If you use them or you lose them, kind of idea. Two like what? only hearts? two hearts. Two hearts. So two popular. Oh, he's already at seven. Wow. This guy rocking it. You in your way for great. <laughs> thank, <laughs> thank you, Pablo. You. We appreciate it. <laughs> You're great too. Thank you for watching. <laughs> yes. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> all right, Nick, are you thirty-one? You're doing your math. Trying to. Uh, so takeaway ten is thirty-nine. Takeaway five more is thirty-four. Uh, four. Right. Oh, I do. I just do it by tens. It's been a like, long day. Yeah, it's long. been a long day. <laughs> Math is not great right now. All right, <coughs> special rules. When one of your combat units, characters, or mechs, remember plastic, moves into a territory containing a Fenris agent, their movement ends. Before continuing with other movements and or aspects of your turn, you must attempt to subdue the agent or agents. One, draw and reveal one combat card per Fenris unit on the territory. This is not combat. Two, Lose your choice of any combination of power, coins, and or oh, popularity wow. equal to the sum of numbers on the combat cards drawn. Wow. A. If you can afford this cost, you must pay if you can. Oh. You successfully subdue the Fenris agent or agents, gain the Fenris combat cards, and place the Fenris agent or agents on your faction map. The agents will factor into an endgame bonus. This is oh. not combat and does not earn you a combat star in bold black text. B. If you cannot afford the cost, pay nothing. Discard the Fenris combat card or cards and return your unit to the territory from which it entered. So just GTFO. But you don't know, so you might as well go in, see what happens, but it doesn't seem to hurt you otherwise, other than you wasted a move action, I guess. <coughs> you may not move a worker by itself into a territory containing a Fenris agent. Only plastic combat stuff. Hmm. Uh, though... Your mech may transport workers as normal. So as long as the mech came in there. The game ends immediately when all eight Fenris agents have been subdued or oh. when a player places their sixth star on the triumph track. Okay. And I'm so sorry, you said equal to or... Uh, so uh, where is it? Lose your choice any of any combination of coins and or popularity equal to the sum equal of the combat to. numbers. Okay. So, so if you flip a these. five and a three, you have to spend eight popularity or coins, any mix of, and if you have the popularity slash coins to pay for it, you must. You must. So you could flip two, and the highest you can lose is ten. So if you're not walking in there with ten bucks, you could be going down to like zero popularity and losing like the few coins you have. Interesting. You have to do two? Well, only oh, for the Oh, no, no. If it's factory, two, I'm saying yes. the worst case it could be. But yeah. if you go into one with just one, you're flipping one card. If you're already holding some fives, you know there's probably less chance of being fives. You could risk it. it should Like, more chance of being a two or a three. Yeah. And you may just have to lose that much money or popularity. So, okay. choice, but you're forced to, and then you'll make that choice then. Wow. So, do the five this plus is So, the goals, episode goals, important. So, do the Fenris agents or win the game. Kind of, those are your two goals to kind of focus on right now. And that's all we'll read for now. Okay. okay. Who is first? I am board Where three. Where did they go? I'm board am, two. I am one. One. <laughs> five. Okay. okay. What were you going to say, sir? What happens when <coughs> you're done? They go to your board. You go to your board, and, and, and it will count. No, it will count, count for the end of the game. Yeah. So it may get you extra stars or extra points or something, or extra money or something. Who knows? You want to go down to the board, and we'll start. Uh, yes. Yeah, so let's jump down to the board. All right. Okay. Welcome Kyle. to Rise of Fenders, episode four. So I'm going to produce on two hexes. Oh, look at you with your extra workers. Two and then one worker, and then I'm going to pay. <coughs> Three. Oh, I'm not going to pay. Never mind. Are you going to use your free? Free. She got no. Her, no. Oh. I did this wrong. Oh, yeah. I forgot about it. Let me Hang do on. that. Can I go back? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah nothing I miscalculated. Else has <clears throat> so not okay, gonna... we're going to start again. So mm -hmm. I'm going to <laughs> yeah, Rob, yeah. pay $1 <laughs> uh, and one combat card. Episode one. Oh, I see. And I'm going to produce on two hexes. So I'll get worker here. You left it all there, you know. And two it. iron. I just I like working it out. And then I get to move one unit two spaces. One, two. And then I'll do my encounter. <coughs> Boom. Goes out firing. And pass me a factory card. We're gonna toss that from the game. Bye, Felicia. So oops. So, card 69, which I think we've had already. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Discuss the blueprints over lunch. Gain two food and one popularity. 
Use technology to assist with roadside construction. Pay three bow power to build one structure. Okay. Yes, I can. Mm, two. Oh. You may build it on any territory you occupy. <coughs> well, that's upsetting. <laughs> Claim this land as your own. Keep this card as a new section of your player mat. The first option is the top row action. The second option is the bottom row action. So you're going to do that one? Yep. <laughs> Good encounter. Okay, you're good. Mm -hmm. I am going to move uh, for one and two. And then I will use my machinery upgrade. I can reduce the cost of one upgrade action to zero oil. I'll flip that over. So I will upgrade. We'll upgrade my move and I will make it cheaper to I will make it cheaper to enlist and then I get one okay. go ahead uh, I'll do a produce here and the food and the food I want to double that. Mm. Do so. I'll wait till I have some more stuff, I think. No, I'll use it right now, actually. Let's get another worker out. Do you double both? Yep. Okay, there you go. It says double uh, production output by workers and mills this turn. I know it's probably better to save it till later, but I want to get going now. <coughs> uh, all right, so that's used. Uh, and then bottom row action, nothing. Go ahead, Nick. <laughs> nice and slick there. It's like ever trying to be quiet. Slick. Gonna trade. Pay okay. one. What would you like? I'll take uh, two oil. That's it. I'm going to pay one dollar or one gold to bolster for two. Oh, hang on. Backing up. Nope, that's what I was going to do. Okay, mine too. <laughs> and then I'm going to use my machinery upgrade, reduce the cost of one uh, upgrade action to zero oil. And now I will... Hmm. Make it cheaper to enlist. Okay. And you, and get, you guys had no upgrade no. action stuff? And you get three coins? Yes. Okay. Uh, myself, I will trade. I will pay one. And I would like to take two food. And just uh, I forgot to talk about the train setup uh, on the video, just if you're curious. Oh, we yeah. have the put the locations in a, in a line. I believe it's a straight line, all connecting, but rivers do not block. Uh, can, Continuity, continuity, sorry, is what I'm trying to say. Uh, so for every one you have in a line adjacent to each other, you're going to get some extra gold. Good to know. Go ahead. Uh, I will, let's move. Uh, one and two. Uh, and then I will do my free enlist on the bottom. Uh, some enlisting neighbors. Mm -hmm. uh, can I get a gold? To you. Uh, let's do uh, which one? Uh, let's do the combat card one. No, let's do the popularity one in the middle for building buildings. And we'll slap it down on combat cards. Can I have two combat cards, please? Let's see. Yeah, what do we got going on here? Hopefully, I get all the high cards off before I go into these spots, and then mm -hmm. I'm good. I'll defeat them all. That's it. Uh, yes. Go ahead. <coughs> going to move. I'm going to pay my two oil. Thanks for your help. Uh, take one money. <laughs> I'll pay attention now. <laughs> <laughs> I know, sometimes you're deep in thought there. Go ahead. 
So gain two food and one popularity. Uh, popularity blue. Uh, it goes on the ink. Oh, no, that's a different thing. Yeah, never mind. It's encounter card, but not the encounter mm -hmm. spot. I get what's happening. And now pay three power to build one structure. You may build it on any territory you occupy. Okay. One, two, three. Mm -hmm. Mine has been built. She's going to fight some Fenris dudes. Well, I don't have any combat cards, so. I don't really have much. No, no, you don't need combat no, cards. No, I know, but. Yeah. You just need money. Money, power. No, it's just popularity or coins. That's all they oh, take it's not from power. you. No. no. Oh, okay. Uh, <laughs> lose your choice of any combination of power. Oh, sorry. Oh, there's power. power. Yes. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Power, coins, and or popularity. Okay. Oh, I forgot the power thing. Yeah, yeah. Sorry. I misspoke earlier. Sorry, guys. Um, so that's different. Okay. You're good? Yep. I am going to produce. To produce on two. So here I will produce an oil. And here I will produce a guy. Uh, okay, then I'm switch this tent. Sorry, it's a new power. Okay, then I will use my recruitment office to enlist. I can reduce the cost of one enlist action to zero food, and I will choose to do. Uh, I'll choose to do the upgrade. So when you guys upgrade, I will get a power. And right now, I will take. I will take two popularity, please, for purple. Uh, and then I get two points for enlisting. Okay. All right. So let's go with. Me to build that. Oh well. We'll trade uh, for one. Oops, sorry. Oh. Let me get um, two oil, please. Uh, and that's it. Go ahead. Nick. I will. Produce, so I can only do two food. There you go. And then the bottom? No. Nope. Oh, oh, shit. On the bowling board. Um, <laughs> I am going to produce, so I'll pay one power. Okay, going to zero with me. I'm going to produce on two hexes, but I'm going to use my auto machines to produ double production output by workers and mills this turn. Okay, so which ones are you choosing? It's two. Oh, okay. So you're going to get four. So there's my four now. worker. One, two, three, four. Wow. And that gives me a star. Wow. Wow, wow. And then I'm going to pay three metal to deploy. No. Nope. No. And I'm going to do... Do I do river walk? I'm gonna do river walk. Okay, and you have to pay how much? Three metal? Uh, three metal, and then I will gain two dollars. Two gold. What's your river go to? From what? Okay. Uh, uh, from to or from any structure. Your structure, like any structure. Uh, on the other side of a river. Yeah. 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 Okay. <coughs> I am going to move. I'm going to move here. And I'm going to move this one here. So I will end my turn here in the encounter, or my movement. Okay, offer protection to the captain. Take $3 from an opponent. You may not attack them until you are attacked by them. Keep this card until then as a reminder. Accept the captain's protection. Pay $3 to an opponent. They may not attack you until you attack them. Keep this card as a reminder. Yeah, or hijack, hijack the airship. Pay three popularity to move your character to the faction if it is empty. The factory, you mean? Factory, sorry. Factory. Does that, that doesn't count as empty, though, does it? No. No, I would say not. Okay. Um, I'm 
I am going to take $3 from Ashley. You may not attack me until I attack you. Isn't that you have to give me $3? Take $3 from an opponent. Oh, I may not. Oh, sorry. Pay them. Oh, it's that out of the way. But there's oh, another one you where. May attack. But there's another one where I you. have to give you money not to attack you. Right, they were oh, take three dollars from an opponent. Yeah. I may not attack them until you are attacked by them. But isn't there not the opposite? Or I can pay someone three dollars. They cannot attack me until I attack yeah. them. But I don't want to pay you. <laughs> also, take your three dollars. So now take you're not allowed to attack me. I cannot attack you until you attack me. Right. Keep the space up so we remember. Okay, that's that. Then I can do my bottom. So what is the rule you picked? I picked uh, the first one. So I took three dollars from Ashley. You can't attack I can't her attack her until her. she caps attacks you. Yeah. Okay. Um, and I just shuffled up these because the last few we saw were all ones we saw yeah. like in the last game, I think. Yeah, so they're both my cards. We just we're pretty sure they've been shuffled, but maybe just not on a proper shuffle, so Paul shuffled it. Anyways. Okay, then I can do the bottom. So I'm going to upgrade. Paying two oil. One, two. Um, I will upgrade my produce. So I can produce on three spots. I will make it cheaper to build. And I will get one dollar. And I will get one power. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Two, three, four. I'm just going to change that like that. Mm. All right. So I will... Let's go bolster. Uh, one, four, two power. Uh, then I'll do my free construction for no wood. Building. Uh, can I have three gold, mm. please? And I'll go up a popularity when I build, and let's build the mill. And let's build that mill. Don't care about straight line business. I mean, yeah, I care more about making metal, pumping the metal out. Maybe I can build here later. Will you let me build there so we can go like a straight line across here? Maybe. No. I'm just kidding. Maybe right. later. Maybe later. Hey, later. Uh, <laughs> Okay, so I build the mill, and I got that, that, and done. Go ahead. What do you do for food? Which one's yours? The same as everybody in list. It's always food. You know the, the action? You can't remember what it does that way. <laughs> I didn't know it was always the same. Yeah. The bottoms are always the same, just different costs. The tops oh, are shuffled around. The, the, the tops okay. move around on everybody's mat. Okay, so then I'm going to bolster, so I'll pay one. Okay. Can you get how many? Two or three? Three. One, two, three. And then I'm going to pay my down. two food. And I'm going to enlist. Enlist? Nope. So I get three bucks back. And... My list. Two hearts. Wow. Different strategy you're playing this time. Sure. Yep, he's learning. We give him some tips. <coughs> Kept his faction. He realized he loves them now. <laughs> no, no, I don't love them. All right, Ash. So I'm going to I'm move. Because <laughs> you may never get the chance to change again, right? <laughs> so it's like, damn it. Four more episodes oh, locked in. There. That's what I'll do. So I'll go like this. They're all going to go with my mech. There. So Are one. you leaving a guy behind or is he going with him? No, he's staying behind. Okay. He'll <coughs> no, go there. So those are my moves. And now he'll turn up a combat card. Mm -hmm. Three. Three. So you have to pay three gold or popularity or power? Three dollars. Okay. So and so now I get that. Discarded. Discard. No, you, don't get, you get it if you subdue You them. get this. You get the card too. Oh, you get the card too? Oh, yeah. Okay, okay. Sorry, guys. No, 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 that's okay. Uh, so 
What did you pay? Three dollars. Three bucks. Because I got a three combat card. All right. If you can afford this cost, you must pay it. If it, and you successfully subdue a Fenris agent, gain the Fenris combat cards and place the Fenris agent on your faction map. <coughs> the agents will favor into an endgame bonus. This is not combat and you don't own your combat store. And then if you can't afford it, blah, blah, blah. You may not move a worker by itself into a territory containing a Fenris agent, only your combat guys. Nicely okay. done. And then I'm going to use my build construction, reduce the cost of one build action to zero wood. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And if I need... <coughs> I feel like I'm going to need power. So is this you produce on two hexes plus your mill? Correct. Yes. Okay. Up to that. You can do less than that many hexes and mills and stuff, but. But here, it would if I like produced here and here, it would only be my mill that produced there. Right? No, nope. all the workers with it. Oh, it's like okay. you're activating that whole hex. Yep. Yep. That's what I'll do. Uh, and that was build. No, nope. I'm good. And I'll get one dollar for that. One gold. <coughs> and go. Okay, I'm going to produce. I can produce on three hexes. So I will take an oil, a food, and I will take a worker. I will then do my bottom action to enlist. Nope. Nope. Okay, so I will pay two oil. I mean, sorry, two food. Uh, <coughs> take this one. Okay, I will take uh, I will take the one when you guys build. Uh, right now I will take two power, one, two, and then I will take two dollars. One, two. Okay. Uh, let's go to move. I'll move my character. And I'll move. <coughs> Let's move these guys in here. Mm -hmm. Two spots. No, I'll leave that there. Move. Okay. Oh, no. I should have produced, I think, first. Sorry. Rewind? Yep. Rewind. Sorry. Uh, produce. Yeah, that's the same. I just moved this guy. Okay. Sorry. Produce. I'll pay a power. Uh, now two hexes, so two more workers I'll do down here, uh, two, food, two metal, two and metal one food. Two metal, one food. Thank you. And then I will spend two oil and a combat card. Let's do this too. Okay. Uh, and that will, uh, I'm upgrading. Uh, okay. I get a power. And two gold, please. Thank you. And this upgrade will be, let's spice up the movements. And let's make mechs cheaper. Okay, uh, go ahead. I'll move. <coughs> Share good news with an old friend. Gain oh. one food, one wood, and one oil. Nice. Train an enthusiastic worker to use your rifle. <laughs> if you don't have a worker star, return one worker to your player mat and gain one recruit. You can't do that either. What does that mean? You would return, return it back. to your mat, but his mat's full. Yeah, Correct. So, I can so do that skip that you. option. Can't even choose it. Damn. And force the workers to work <laughs> overtime. Pay two <laughs> popularity to take another turn immediately <clears throat> after the current turn. Okay, well, first I'm going to gain one food, one wood, and one oil. That's a good one. On the encounter spot. Or Sorry. Sorry. Then I guess I will pay the two popularity, which I'm not going to do now. We have propaganda here. Okay. I'm turning that over. Yep. Now I get to take a turn again. Okay. After your turn is done. So finish uh, your current turn, because so that was just after your movement. So if you have oil now or... Uh, no, there's not <coughs> nope. oil. Okay. So now 
else, start another turn. Pick another spot on your mat and carry on. Okay, then I will produce. I'll do one worker. Yeah. Okay. And one food. And bottom row on that is a whole Not bunch enough. of wood. Yeah. No, that's <laughs> Whoa. Okay. Yeah, that's the board I had before, man. It's expensive on the building stuff. All right, Ashley, what do you got there, uh, Vesna? I'm going to go pay a dollar. I'm going to trade for one food and one wood. I like to keep my stuff. I'll forget it. Actually, no, I don't. Oh, why is there a mill there? You put that there. Oh, oh, I'm stupid. Oh, I wasn't paying attention. I didn't even notice it there. Oh, well. Oh, that's well. That's not where I was supposed to build it, but that's yeah. fine. Well, you can't build two on the same place. Yeah, can you? so that's illegal. We totally missed that. We so, missed it. that's where I was going to build it, and it hasn't affected my game at all. Well, yeah, okay. you produced on that spot using the mill, right? No, I didn't. No, 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 she just no. asked the question. I just asked the question oh, so that I knew. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Okay, yeah, if you didn't produce there, who No, cares? I haven't yep. produced there. So, we'll do that. That's what it was supposed to be. <clears throat> Bottom or no? Uh, yeah. So sorry. That was. I don't remember what I was doing. Oh, I took one wood, one food, and now I'm going to pay three food to enlist. I do. Nope. And I'm gonna make it so that when you guys upgrade, I gain a power. And right now I will take two power. Okay, you're good. And I will get nothing for that. Okay. I will move. I will move one. And did that wrong again. You can undo. Well, no, I just forgot to put my trap when she was here because I didn't even take them out of the okay. thing yet. So just do it. Like, so the traps you have, just let everyone know what total traps you should have done yeah. to start the game, so right? So I have... Minus four money, minus two combat cards, minus two uh, popularity, or minus three power by stepping on any of the traps. You don't know which trap she's going to put out, so keep those now face down. Yeah, I'm just going to... And gonna... choose, yep. And then... So this is the one that I accidentally sure. missed yep. before. Let's play catch up here and correct. So let's do that. Okay, so now I'm moving... Uh, so I move that one worker. I'm going to move that one that way. I just want to make sure I go the right way. <clears throat> okay, and I'm just going to put them on my board so I don't forget. Okay, now I'm going to pay two oil from here to upgrade. Yes, I go up a power. Nope. Up a power for you. Okay, I will upgrade my bolstering I will make it cheaper to build and I will then get one coin and I will get one power <coughs> that is me okay I will uh, trade I'll pay uh, one mm -hmm. uh, the two resources I will take are <coughs> let's go to oil down here uh, and then I will do two plus a combat card uh, three there two metal and I'm deploying a mech uh, for my neighbors uh, let's get river walk going uh, let's throw this guy down here and I don't get any money on this okay go ahead Nick I'm going to pay a dollar to bolster. So it's three power for white. Three power, one, two, three. Gosh. And then I'm going to pay the two food to enlist. Uh, Gain two bucks. Actually, I'll gain five because I get. I can get three. it for you. Just okay. tell me. You want three? Five. Five. 
Okay, that's it. Okay, I'm gonna pay one power and one popularity one and power, one dollar. One popularity. <coughs> give her down one. To Gladly. Produce. <laughs> so that will give me two metal and one, two, three, four, five. Is that oil? He's there. Yeah, oil. Five, one, two, three, four, five. There you go. You're in this spot, right? Because you have a mill. But I have nothing to produce there. Oh, it's a worker, worker oh. right? Oh, yes, your workers yeah. are all out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, um, and and then I'm going to pay three metal to deploy. Yeah, I should take metal first. Uh, one for that. <coughs> and I will do speed. You will. Mm. <coughs> Me? I. No, I'll give two dollars. I'm going to trade. I will pay one. I will take two wood. I will then do my bottom action to build. Mm, I go up a popularity. Two wood. Mm. I will build the mill. I think. Yeah, I'll build the mill here, uh, and then I get a popularity when I build, so purple up one. That's me. All right, I will produce, pay a power, uh, pay a popularity, and I will produce uh, two metal, if you could bear, mm -hmm. uh, one food, and my last two workers, I guess. Uh -oh. Ding! Star power. Star power. Uh, and then bottom row action. Let's do two oil plus a combat card. <clears throat> and I am going to upgrade neighbors. Upgrade. Neighbors, I upgrade. get a power. Okay. Can I get two gold, please, from the okay. pool? And my upgrade is going to be. Popularity one uncovered. Let's reduce the cost of mechs again. All right, go ahead, Nick. I'll trade. Pay a dollar. And I'll take uh, one oil and one metal. <coughs> and I can't do my bottom action. So I'm going to pay a dollar to bolster, so three power. And then I will pay three oil to upgrade. Ooh, I get a power. And I also get a power and three dollars. I get a power. The power. The power. <coughs> You're good? Yes. I'm going to produce. I'll pay the power you just gave me. I will produce, I can produce on three, so I will produce a worker here. I will produce two food here. And I will produce two here, two oil here. One, two. Uh, I will then do my bottom action to enlist. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Uh, no. I will enlist two and three. Enlist three, two. I will enlist the one when you guys deploy. I will get a dollar. Uh, right now I will take two dollars from that. And then, where am I at? and then when I enlist, I get two dollars. I will change those in, in a second. That is me. Uh, so I will, let's trade, I'll pay one, get two oil. Trading these in for five. Two oil. I'm stop for a sec. Yeah, uh, Bart saying, I wish you all a great night. And as the Dutch say, Slap Liker Welterstein. I don't know how to say that. I'm sorry if I'm butchering it. It means good night and sleep well, Bart. Oh, thank, thank you. Thank you again for hanging out with us on the live stream like you were yesterday. We appreciate it. Uh, you can always watch the rest of this later. But thank you for being here. We appreciate it. And we'll see you in another live stream. Have a good night. Good night. Good night. Happy New Year. Uh, okay. 
Sorry. Uh, yes, I don't remember. Uh, I got some top row action oil, then bottom row action for, uh, let's do one metal and one combat cart. Uh, let's get another mech on there. I'll throw my speed mech into play. Are you buck. deploying? I deploying, get a Deploying, neighbors. Deploying. I get a buck. And on to you, Nick. Go ahead. <clears throat> okay, I am going to move two of my finest people. One, two. And I'm going to pay my two oil. Pay attention. Uh, someone there saying Descent Third Edition? Question mark? Well, I think that's what's coming for sure. I don't know. If, did they announce anything yet? But I, I know it's coming. It's for sure. They already talked about how they're going to do something new with Descent this year. Something big's coming. Hopefully it's more on the level of like complexity of Gloomhaven and some of the other big box games. Oh, and not nice. just like an entry level dungeon crawler. I hope they like use some new up to date mechanics and stuff. And definitely make it more co-op based. No dungeon master stuff. And kind of do a better job if they use an app uh, to really, really flesh it out. Um, but we'll see. Yes, yeah, so I'm excited. Upgrade. Upgrade. Oh, I gained one power. Nothing for me. <clears throat> oh, what am I going to do? Are you done? Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> <laughs> Once one person looks, I know because I forget about day. them completely. I can move through tunnels. That's the only tunnel that doesn't have one of these guys on it. I can also move through rivers from a structure to an adjacent structure, which I don't think I can do anywhere. You want to fight any of these orange guys? Freaking no. <laughs> <laughs> Ruin my plans. Hi, dude. Mm-hmm. Sorry. I'm not. And I have the plus one. Oh, that won't matter. Okay. Which popularity do I have? Three. You're sitting on three popularity. I'm on the low side here. Mm -hmm. Yep, people hate you. <laughs> in RL it's like real and life. the game, yeah. You're getting some mean mug and looks over here. Dirty stuff for I said about you in the chat earlier. No, I'm just joking. I believe it. You hate the what's there, the uh, Vesna player. Okay, I'm Vesna gonna. Bitch. No. Okay, I'm just gonna do this. Pay one power. Gain two popularity. Oh. I'm going to move one worker to, or one unit to spaces. Yep, yep, yep. Just toss it again. And it could be any unit. Yep. Yep. Up to two spaces. If it's plastic, you get the plus one speed bonus attached to it, too. So I can move them three. Mm hmm So. You should go in these spaces right here. Mm -hmm. I wanted I to. I recommend. So there's a building here, so I could go here. Yeah, I think so. And then I could go to the factory. Matter if it's through the water? I yeah, that's her whole river walk thing is jumping yeah. across because there's a structure on the other side. Because I have a structure. Oh. I think. The arrow goes both ways. It says move across rivers to or from an adjacent territory containing a structure. And the arrow. Okay. Yeah, to or from yeah. is good. Okay. Yep, yep. Uh, Change your mind. Oh, rolling oil. Like the boss. I might. The boss. But I don't really have that the much to like, lose at this point. Yeah, it's going to flip two cards. Yeah. So it could go anywhere oh, from power. 4 up to 10. Okay, I'm going to do that. Yeah, you can lose popularity. Go nuts. But I'm going to go here and do it. Okay, so that stops. You have to do this before continuing anything else on your movement stuff. So do the whole flipping a card thing. Come right? on, uh, five. Hang on. I'm going to do it with this guy, though. It's okay, good. it's okay. We don't have anywhere yeah. to go. <laughs> we don't have a child waiting for us at home. <laughs> okay. Okay, so flip the card. Five. Five. Yeah! yeah. There you go. All right, <laughs> well, so your choice. Coins, power, much. or uh, a popularity. Any mix of. A little bit of everything, whatever you want. 
I'll do three coins, one popularity, and one power, and one power. Okay, put the coins in the trash there, and uh, you, so get, you that, get that you get five. that five combat card, oh, which yeah. is pretty juicy, actually. Oh yeah, <laughs> convenient. <laughs> and you get that guy on your player map. Yes. <laughs> and uh, oh, and that was your card, right? So you don't have a bottom line. Okay. Uh, shoot, what the heck was I gonna do now yeah. that we? Oh yeah. I am going to move. I can move up to three things. Um, one. Two. Three. Okay, stop. You have to do this now. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, so we'll do the whole card flip. You know, it needs to be done. Seven. Two. Two. So I need a mix of... Faulty Joe, thank you for subscribing. You. We appreciate the support. Thank you so much. Okay. I, love, I love the caption. Yeah, I know. Awesome. I will pay two points. I will take this. I will get this. And I will drop a trap so token. One guy just said there's a spoiler. Those guys blow up and cost you 15 every. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Keep taking Enjoy, them. enjoy. No, they're part of what you're working towards. They're definitely <laughs> going to be something and giving you awesome stuff in the next mission for sure. Okay. Then I will do my bottom action. Oh, and the game ends when they're all gone, by the way, too. So yeah. we can rush the game faster without doing Does it. Like, look at the stars nobody's getting. But the game will end once those are we all just gone. Finally Does it? Out, though. Yeah, that's right here. I read it. The game ends immediately when all eight Fenris agents have been subdued. Oh. Or when a player places their sixth star on the triumph track. Well, then. Okay, I'm going to do my bottom action to upgrade. Oh. Paying two oil. I get a power. Okay. I will upgrade my trade action, making it cheaper to deploy. I will get one coin, and I will get one power. Okay. Go ahead. Mm -hmm. uh, let's go with... Uh, okay. Hmm. Combat cards are combat cards. Oh, they're glitching a little bit. In the well, oh, it's, it's loading. probably just hot. Uh, it was doing like the loading symbol. Oh, well, it's still going. Yeah. Just. Be good. But anyways, uh, okay. I just want to do my list. Yeah, let's do a move. Uh, move my little thing. Whoops. Let's move one. Okay. Uh, let's move. Thank you. Let's go. Let's go all of these guys up here with this guy and let's bring uh, do I do one more where else can you go you know all oh, you got the river walk yeah I got oh. river walk and yeah do Sorry. these count as structures or are they just tunnels they're tunnels. They don't count as structures no they're just tunnels okay mm. Uh, let's keep on, so I can do three units, yeah, so let's do, uh, one more over here. Should have probably went through and picked up on the way. Yeah, let's say I move this guy, oh, this guy's already there. This, oh, this guy can just carry more in, right, he has one more move. So yeah, I can just... Does he have plus one? Yep. Yep. Only class six to you. Okay. You gotta play on the bigger tile side. Yeah, I know. I was thinking <laughs> that before. I'm like, oh, we only have four players. Not needed. Okay, so end of movement. I will take an encounter. All right. Uh, so we got some, looks like some archery at a fair or something here. Card number 13. Enjoy an afternoon festival with the commoners. Gain two gold and one popularity. Enter a battle of wits and lose on purpose. Pay two gold and gain two power and two popularity. 
Or drink too much and raid the storehouse. <laughs> pay three popularity and gain five resources. Let's do the pay two. The second option. Pay two gold. I'll gain two power up to seven and two popularity up to five. And that is that. Uh, and bottom row action. I will spend three food. And let's enlist. Neighbors, yeah. can I get a gold please? And we're going to take off this one. And let's go for... Mm, two power. Bang, bang. Nick? Go pay a dollar to... Sorry, where is it? Yep, pay a dollar to trade. I'll take two medals, but just keep it because I'm going to do my deploy action. It's going to cost me one. That gets me nothing. Deploy? Do you have anything to deploy? Uh, no. Submerge. Okay, I'm going to submerge. Okay. And I get $1. Or, sorry, wait. No, I don't get a dollar for that. Because <laughs> that was here. Can you deploy him? You get, yeah. a dollar. Oh, you get a dollar. You still get a dollar. Yep. Okay, mm -hmm. I'm gonna move. So you get this every single time. Every single time you do it or they oh, do it. I don't think I ever have done that. <laughs> I always think it's when you guys do no, it. No, there's three people in that bubble. One. Oh, I need them to keep building. <clears throat> One, two. I'm moving two. And then. Oh, I'm an idiot. That's fine. <laughs> Sucks when you can't do the I'm same do this. thing five times in a row. It does. <laughs> the first time. Uh, so I got side. an encounter token. Okay. I was hoping this will help me get what I need. <coughs> What's your encounter token? Until from? your next turn. Oh, she moved. Mm. Your opponent, when your opponents pay resources to take bottom row actions, they must place those resources on your character's territory. <laughs> wow. Uh, confront, so that's collector quota. Confront the approaching mech to save the farmers. Pay seven power, which I don't have. Oh, you may use combat cards mm. cool. to gain four popularity mm. and two food, which is not what I need. <laughs> uh, incite, incite the farmers to fight with the mechs and pay three popularity to gain one mech. So I'm going to do collect your quota until your next turn. When your opponents pay resources to take bottom row actions, they must place those resources on your character's territory. That's oh. annoying. What does that mean? So whenever so we, if you guys, we have to pay her what we spend on bottom row actions. Exactly. Her turn like again. anything we spend on a bottom row action, resource wise, goes on her character spot. So she owns it. Just don't do anything this round. Well, that's also <laughs> sucky too. But maybe we can give her what she's needed. And I couldn't do my bottom row action. Okay, so no. Okay, well that kind of changes slightly then. What I will do, I will. I will trade. I will pay one. I will take two oil. <coughs> and and no. All right, so I am going to go with, um, let's go trade. I'll pay one. And I will take a wood, oops, a wood and a metal. And we will go here. And then bottom row action. Uh, I will pay two metal and put it on her character spot right here. And then I will deploy neighbors. Okay, I will get a dollar. And I get a dollar. Um, take my scout right here. And no other money or anything. Nick, go your turn. Okay, I will. Oh, wait, sorry, rewind. 
after I took my metal and my wood, mm -hmm. I had one of each resource, right? So after my top row action, sorry, mm -hmm. I have that same hedger bets. Oh, okay. So at least one upgrade, which I have two. At least one mech, done. At least one structure. My mill is in there somewhere. Uh, one recruit, definitely two have gone. And one of each other resource. Yeah, I was supposed to do it after I collected oh, yeah. that. That's yep. why I did the two different. And then that's end of my turn. You still have it now anyways. One, two, three. Uh, but no, I spend the metal. Oh, the metal. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, I see. I think. Yeah. Uh, and yes. now we would go, and now we would collect everything as normal. Okay. Yeah. Or, actually, hold on. And one of each resource at the end of your turn. Yeah. Shit. That's okay, bad. so I'm putting my dollar back that I got from you deploying. Okay, so I will... Yeah, sorry. I That's won't okay. deploy... I'll hold it just so I can get this star instead. Yep. So then she doesn't get any resources. That's unfortunate. Yeah, that's better that way. Right? <coughs> uh, so I'll keep that there, and I get a star for an objective. That was my plan. There you go. Yeah, it's better not to spend. So it's like, yeah, that's, that's a better call than that. Okay, I will move. Splash. Splash. Bottom row? Nope. Ashley. All right. <laughs> that gets turned down? <laughs> yeah, no yep. more. Uh, no reason uh, to not her. Gone. <laughs> oh. I'll teach you. <laughs> I know. Okay. <clears throat> so, gain two food and one popularity. Uh, up to four or five, sorry, five, I think. Yep. I think I just knocked it, but I'm pretty sure it was sure. Oh, four. <clears throat> and oh, then pay three power to build one structure, and you may build it on any ter territory you occupy. <clears throat> oh. What am I going to do first? Probably this one. Go for that straight line? No, no it's you, not going to help that's me. That's fine, but you still have two in a row. Yeah. But does that count as two different separate ones? Well, you one, just go two. for whatever straight line you have is like the longest one, I would assume, and you're good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because it's like a continuous line, so however long you can get. If you can get all Three. four together in a line, you get the most. Okay, here. Okay, and that was your bottom row. Yeah. Uh, you're good to go. I'm going to move one so he's going to carry that on his back uh, that's going to stay there stay right there uh, this guy is going to move here yeah drop that um, then I will do my bottom action. I think that is where I want my guys. Actually, I'll, <coughs> I moved one, two, I'll move this guy for three. I can move three guys. I don't need that right now. Then I will do my bottom. I will upgrade. Gain two oil. One, two. So I get one power for that. Um, I will upgrade my, so I get, I get two coins, making it cheaper to deploy. I will get one coin and I will get one power. Okay. Um. Uh, let's produce. Uh, I'll pay a power. I will negate the um, up to two popularity from an action or encounter. So the produce action will negate the popularity loss. Uh, and spend that propaganda token. I will lose some money. Yeah. I will then um, produce, I guess, just these two spots. So one, two, three, four, five metal there. Oh, actually, I'm going to build this here. Uh, yeah, no, you need to have a worker to do that. Yeah. No, it said any territory you occupy. Oh, because you oh. with that. Yeah, it says build it on any territory you occupy. Oh, that's cool. Okay, so five okay. metal here, and then, and then two, uh, three, three, three food. Yeah. Two, three, one, two, three. And then bottom.
bottom row action. Oh, fail bottom. Uh, no comment card. Pass. Go ahead. Okay, I'm going to produce. You don't have to pass it to me. I got three wood. And then it's going to cost me one to build. And I'm build? going to nope, build. Nope. Oh, you build get... cost you four. How yeah, but he, <coughs> he was getting a three and he gave me one. Oh, and there was one already there? Yeah. I yeah. get it. Okay. Yep. So you get a heart? Oh, nice. And then he gets and I two, get two bucks. Yeah, that's it. I'm going to pay one dollar. Oh, yes. Uh, I'm going to take a food and a wood. Thank you. Mm -hmm. And I gain a power. And then I'm going to pay three food to enlist. Oh, nothing for me. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> and I'll gain a power. Or sorry, a popularity when I build or you guys build. And right now I will take two popularity. Actually, two dollars. Two dollars. Okay, and you're done? Yep. I am going to produce. I can produce on three. I need to, need to pay one power. Uh, so we're going to do here for food. Here for three metal. One, two, three. And here for two oil. Okay. Then I will do my bottom action to enlist. Pay uh, comment card, please. Two food. One, two. I will enlist my final guy, getting two combat cards right now. Thank you. Uh, then I also get two dollars. I'll give you one, one for a three. Thank you. Uh, and then I get another combat card. Sorry. That is me. Uh, let's go trade. I'll pay one. Can I get two back if you don't mind? Thank you. And let's go with uh, two wood. Oops, sir. Put that here. And then I will deploy a mech in two metal. A dollar for me. Uh, and that mech. Oh, I didn't actually. To Wayfair, drop it here. And that is me. Go ahead. <clears throat> okay, I'm going to move. <clears throat> oh, nice. that, right? yep. yep. So right now, stop the two. Com uh, actually, it's one unit at a time because they, they don't carry each other. Okay. So when you want to go in there, does it matter? Well, it's a factory. This guy well, won't yeah, do that's, anything. Oh, sorry. Yeah. That's right. He's coming <laughs> so in regardless. So do they both flip over? Yes. So right now, stop. Yep. Flip over two. So two, you have to five. lose five worth of popularity, money, and or power. Your choice. Uh, let's do... And you want to pay it. One for me. And then you'll get these cards. So let's do one... One power. One power for one money, you. Okay. Or one thing. Three money. Three bucks. So these cards are yours now. And these guys are on your player board there. You throw them on the board. And now you get to do and this. Factory. Well, uh, I think you finish all your oh, movement sorry, now. That thing okay, just I'll interrupts it. it. I'm not going to yep, do it yet, but any other this is going to get moved in here for yep. protection. So that's two units you've moved. You can move one more. That's it. Okay, yeah. now uh, look at all those and pick your factory card. I messed up on something. It's my own fault. <clears throat> I 
don't think you have to wait for me to do that. I can't. No, I can't do, do the bottom. section after. I can't do it. Oh, you can't. I got do no that? money. Okay. Here, I got no so money. go ahead. Go ahead. Okay. Sorry, I don't want to slow the game down. Uh, I'm going to. <clears throat> I'm gonna do. What are you doing? Let us know. Tell us what you do. So I'm going to produce. So I'm gonna pay a power, a popularity, and one dollar. Popularity, power, you got her. Mm -hmm. One dollar. Yep. Sorry. And then I'm so I'll produce on two because my mill doesn't do anything. So I'll get two metal. One, two, three, four, five. Metal. Five. And I will pay three metal to deploy. Deploy, I get one dollar. So do I. Here's Which three. gives me two dollars. Oh. Uh, Did you get tons? Oh, you got the health. So oh, I'll do oh, artillery. So Before okay. combat, if you pay one power, your opponent gets a minus two. <laughs> um, and we have a mech. Or a worker with one. Yes. <laughs> Did awesome. I get rid of my throw them back already? God, I don't think so. Okay, you're done? Yep. I am going to bolster. I will pay one. Oh. I will go up three power. One, two, three. Okay. I will then do my bottom action to spend two metal to yeah, deploy. deploy. Ah. Okay. I will deploy um these guys aren't technically units, right? It oh, says before combat where that. you have exactly one unit. He, it's only the fighters, right, that are the units? Obviously, those guys can't go in and start a combat by themselves. But are these considered units if they were in there? Yeah. I would think so, yeah. yeah I yeah. think so, okay. Yeah, yeah. Um, we can check. It is the turn units, I think. Yeah. Okay. I think I'll... It's okay. I'm going to deploy that one well, anyways. But it might, yeah, it might come up later. Uh, so I'm going to deploy that... Uh, when I do, I get four dollars, so I'll just uh, types of units. Each of the three units in the there, each of the three unit types in the game characters, max and workers, share two key. Okay. Yeah, these are so units. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. I will let's go to bolster. I'll pay one. Um, that's two. Let's go two power. And then bottom row action. Let's do two wood and a combat card. Yep. And I am building neighbors. Building, I get building. three gold, please. Whoa, whoa. You can move my heart up one for purple. Of course. Three. And I'll move up mine one. And then the building I'll build is the mine. Let's throw it right here. And go ahead, Nick. Going to pay a combat yeah. card. Okay, any three resources. Which resources do you want? I'm gonna do three metal. Three metal. That's such a good card. Actually, I lied. I lied. Two food and one oil. That's totally different. Yeah, I was gonna say that. <laughs> so let's put them anywhere you got workers, which seems like that's the only spot. Okay, and then I can move one unit up to two spaces. So I can go bam bam. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Nice. So take that counter. I'll oh, put that That's in the, the discard one pile. Cost me yet. And there you go. <clears throat> Help guide the fluffy herd back home. Gain two dollars and one popularity. Direct the sheep to greener pastures. Place all food tokens from the general supply as many as 20 on the farm tunnel territory. Right here. Oh, jumping. Oh, thank you. Hell no. Do it. I'll get it before her. 
Yeah, why do I want you to get it? <laughs> <laughs> Pay two popularity. Each opponent gains one food on their character's territory, but they cannot move units on their next turn. Ooh. <clears throat> so I'm going to gain two dollars and one popularity first. So here's a dollar. Okay, two so dollars for that. Three dollars for three. And then do I want to get rid of some popularity here? Two popularity gain, one food. Where's your guy on right now? For what? What is Ask the? Your where's, your, where's your pawn on? Uh, your right now on bolster slash build. Bolster. I just want to make sure if you guys are all on move. Oh, yeah. It's that not doesn't worth make sense. Oh, I see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm also on produce. I'm not on move. Although, actually, I should, maybe I should have done the 20 things there. Yeah, it's only and what's then left. Stopped so. you. Oh, well, that is what moving. you should have done. Still do done that. it and then stopped us all from moving. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Next <clears> time. Can do both. Yeah, yeah. But he already done, did one, so you'd have to take back the other one. Which is fine. I don't think I could get there. But yeah, because he only can move one space because he doesn't have his other oh. mech unlocked, so he's only got one space of movement for all his dudes. Except yeah. this one. Okay, oh, easy. But he's already on He's on, on it. Oh. Yeah. Okay, that's... Uh, he hasn't done that. You don't have to do them all, up to no, two. No, I don't think I'm going to. First time ever. <laughs> okay. Uh, now that was your top row action. Oh, that was your bottom one. That was my yep. bottom Okay, Ashley, your turn. I'm going to pay a dollar. Okay. Hello. To bolster... So three, I go up. One, two, three. And then I will pay three oil to upgrade. I get a power. You get a power? Which nope. also gives me a power. And I will make it cheaper to build. Okay. I will... One, two. I will move. Um, let's do this first. Okay, flip a card. Two. Two. I will pay. I'll pay a three at the beginning of the one. Okay. And you you get this up. guy in the card. Thank you. Okay, that's one movement. I can do three. Uh, let's do. Don't remember that. So let's take this guy. Do that and that's it for movement. I will then do my bottom row action to upgrade, paying two oil. I go up one power. Okay, I okay. will then upgrade this one, giving me more combat cards, making it easier to deploy, and then I will gain a coin. Gain a power, and that was my last upgrade. So if you can put me on the oh, first the one there, one, the upgrade so. one, the very first one. That is me. Right. Don't end the game. I'll move. Don't end the game. I need one more turn. You can't end the game. Just to laugh. Well, because the salmon guys it, probably are the way to do it. He can. Yeah. Oh, although he probably could actually. Uh, okay. He could. Let's go. One. Two. Uh, that's one unit and two more. Let's go through the mine. Let's start by hitting up. Oh, sorry, hitting up here, and then we'll deal with that. Can you flip me a card, please? Yep. Is it only the character? Is it? I thought it was only your character. Sorry. I thought just when the one of worker. your combat units, oh. characters or mechs, moves into a territory containing a friendless agent, their movement ends. Sorry. Before continuing with other movements and or other aspects of your turn, you must attempt to subdue the agents. But you can't move in there with workers on their own. Yeah, yeah. No. Sorry. Three. Three. Uh, let's go down. Three gold. All right. That's uh, yours. So the card. That Thank is you. yours. Thank you. All right, uh, so continuing movements, I can do one more unit, and my plastic can move up to two. These guys are on this spot here. Let's go. Uh, carry all these workers in here, and then let's go. Could hit that one and just end it. 
But I feel like I'm way behind on money over here. Holy. And money over here. Holy crap. Um, it's still very early in the game, tell me. No, it's not, though. Can Two stars. Can... I know, but that's because these rules have, have got everyone to go for that, and it's setting all our resources back that you would normally be using to get stars, mm -hmm. right? Because like people are dropping power, popularity, and stuff, and they're like, I don't want to end it yet, and they're not getting stuff. Okay, uh, so that was here, then to here, and, and that, here. One st that one right. stopped. This one went as far, and that's three. Okay, so bottom row action. I will spend three food, and I am enlisting neighbors. Enlisting. I get a card. Oh, me too. I get a card and a gold, please. Thank you. Here you go. Oh, I um, guess I could have paid a combat card for one of those food, which I will do. Because I had one from that whole subdued guy thing. Right? Uh, that's a gold. Okay. And then enlisting. Let's do this one. Take, let's take two gold. Can I have two gold, please? All right, Nick, your turn. Pay a dollar to bolster up three power. White. One, two, three. Up a heart. I'm going to pay the two food. To enlist. Nope. Get in here enlisting. You get a combat card. Yay. Mm-hmm. You got it. And then I get uh, three dollars. And a combat card. I took the combat, took card. Oh, combat took card. Okay. And then I get to move a guy. Enlist. Yep. And then pick whatever you're getting this time as your one time power. bonus. Okay. Two power. Two power for, for white. white. One, two. Okay. I am going to move, and I can move three units. So I'm going to do we're going to go one, two. Oh, they were going to stay behind them. <laughs> That's one. I'm trying to spread some people out here. Okay. Hmm. He's going to move here, or she's going to move there. Is the structure? Yep. Final rabbit says, I'm back. What I miss? <laughs> Did I win yet? Did you win a yet? Lot. Uh, no, you <laughs> lost. Sorry. Yeah, no, you lost. Uh, but you win now because you're back. All right. Hey, Vinyl. Um, yeah. If I go here with a worker, does it trigger it? Um, I believe so. Let me just confirm for you. I don't know if a worker can go Triggering in there. a tra trap. And if, if an opponent moves a unit onto a okay, territory yeah. with an armed trap token, the unit's movement ends, flip over the trap token to reveal yeah, a penalty to the opponent. And they're all bad. They are all bad. Yep. Yeah, so you lose some power, you can lose some popularity, you can lose some combat cards, I think, or some money. Mm -hmm. I forget what they all are. Yeah, they were combat cards. It's like all the resources. Money, popularity, or power. It's a gamble. But it stops her from then owning that territory I as a know. bonus. Because right now she's getting three extra locations from just those chilling there. But is it worth the gamble? And can you afford to lose what it could be? No, probably not. <laughs> have you seen what I have here? I know that red faction was really good, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's getting used to Okay. Uh, Rob, did you get your promo chips from Shipley? No, I have not. I haven't got any email or anything that they shipped or anything. I should probably check uh, the, the ordering system to see if they even shipped. But there's it was still in processing when I checked uh, a few days ago. Um, okay, so then this 
Makes How about you, Vinyl? Like stomps. So like jumping on your head, yeah. It makes them retreat, right? Yes. And I lose three popularity for it. Yes. Yeah, I was very ups- upset that you put three workers there. They were there since we started the no, game. No, yeah, there was the only, only been there was only one, one worker there. <laughs> there was only, only one, one, and then you Until moved the other two. Until three turns ago, I haven't been to move for three or four rounds. No, there was only one there when I went there. Yeah, what's happened? Is that the only um, spot you have so, to be in? She has a card. Card. Send oh. one back as a warning. Have at least seven power. Complete a move action that this turn that forces at least one enemy worker to retreat. But you don't have seven power. Yes, yeah, she does right yeah, here. Yeah. Oh, seven. Oh, that yeah. nice power. So that's a star. So put your star on the objective spot and bango, bango. Um, and then I will pay two wood to build. I will get a heart, please. Oh, bumping me up to the next level. Thank you, Ashley. You're welcome. And then that will give me a star. And I earn. For what? What'd you do? Need to end it. Building. A dollar and one popularity for building. And I'll put this. Don't need to end it yet. Here. Yeah, I do. Well, she has very little stars. She got or very four, little. three stars. Yeah, yeah but she's, the gonna, most. Ah, but she's only going to get three on them. She's not going to get that high in two rounds. You're good? Oh, I can't even end it because I can't move. All right, what are you doing? So then I am going to... I'm going to bolster. Okay. Uh, pay pay one. one. Go up one, two, three. Uh, I will get four dollars, so I will just take that. For what? Not for bolstering. That's or deploying. Sorry, action. sorry. Now I'm going to deploy. I'm sorry. I'm okay. just getting ahead of myself. So I already. Let me so just deploy. Take that back. Does that do anything for your run? Uh, yep. Yeah, I get a gold. So pay a metal. Sure she does your action correctly. Sorry. In my head, I was doing it. Okay. So then I'm going to deploy um, this one that lets me uh, reset traps, and let's put it where I have a worker. I'll put it here. You get your four gold. Uh, so now I'll pay the one and then take Okay. All right. You pass me a gold. And oh, gosh, that's the one I know. That is me. Good. Yeah. All right. I forgot what I was doing. All right. Let's do. I'll go here. I'll pay one. Uh, oops, sorry. Uh, to trade, I just want to popularity. I thought you or wanted to go here. resources. Mm, no, let's go popularity uh, to nine. And then I will do bottom row action of a metal and a combat card to deploy neighbors. Okay, I get one dollar. So do I. Just my final mech, uh, which will drop here, and that will give me a star on mechs. Star power. And then it will give me a gold, please, for doing that bottom row action. And Nick, your turn. I will pay a combat card. I'll take three resources, so I'll take two food and one oil. Actually, no, the oil you got got scammed from me. So what do you want? Uh, metal. Can I put them anywhere, actually? Uh, My workers it has are just where workers are. At home. They go home. They can do that? Mm-hmm. They can still be used? Yeah, I think so, yeah. You don't you control that spot. I know it's not a territory or anything, but I don't know where else it would go. Because that's where your workers are. And it has to go on a spot with your workers, so. Sorry. That nothing. would be crazy if somebody could lock you out of getting resources. I think okay. that's like too powerful. <laughs> <laughs> so then everyone could just be running and fighting each other, knocking their guys back. Like, yeah, you can't make anything. <laughs> yeah, no word. Hmm. Yeah, I have a feeling all the uh, vinyl, all the um, like distribution centers, like um, oh, cool stuff, Inc. What are they called? The shipping company, uh, whatever they're shipping out of, uh, I forget what it's called. Quartermaster Logistics. Go check their Twitter and stuff. They, you can ask them on there what's happening with that because uh, okay. they fulfill daily orders from Chip Theory, so for the U.S. and Canada. 
So go on Quartermaster Logistics, hit them up on Twitter or Facebook, and message them and ask what's going on with oh, Chip yeah. Theory daily orders based on oh, December, God. Black Friday orders, whatever, November, oh, I guess. It's been a while. Um, yeah, they'll know. If I upgrade, I thought we can get another room. But I bet because the holidays are all slacking off there, skeleton crew, not enough people working. They're just not in a rush. I pay a dollar, bolster for three, one, two, three, and then I will pay three oil. I was thinking I'm doing that. Were you? Mm -hmm. To enlist. Why are you paying a food? Not a food. Sorry. Whoa. And mine. Yeah. Oh, it jumped. Oh, wow. <laughs> and then I'll get one game. more. So what are you doing? And you'll get one too. And right? I will. Yeah. And then upgrading. So what she's upgrading. You? Oh, so I, I get a star. Upgrade. I upgraded. So you go okay, up a power. power too. You move neck up a power. Uh, Nick, yep. Wait. Power. I want a game of safe by boxing in the purple guys and preventing them from using their special power. Not a happy player. Oh, <laughs> I could imagine. Oh, I could imagine. You're done? Yep. Okay, so I have to do this. I, oh, game. Oh, I have to. Yeah. Come on. Because I'm afraid this oh, might what? be my only shot to actually win the game. So I'm going to jump to here. Okay, so stop so that. stop there. Uh, flip a card. Call my card. I could have done that too, you know. So could I. Two. I could have. Two. Uh, I'll just pay two power. All right. Uh, so and you get that card. And this and, and this. Like and the game is done. So game ends immediately when eight Fenris agents have been subdued. So stop. All right. Let's total it up. So uh, bottom here is uh, Vesna, <laughs> a.k.a. Always. Ashley. Uh, so how many stars did you get? Three. So three times three is nine. Uh, locations you control. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight. Eight times two, sixteen. So sixteen 20. plus nine. Twenty. No, you said what? Nine you have three 16. stars times three is oh. nine. Plus now I forget. Sixteen, 16. is twenty-five. Twenty-five, and then resources. I see one, two, three. Three. So it's only 26. one extra gold. Six. That's horrible. Oh, and then this one. Uh, oh, and down here. How many you have here, which is a straight line, or here is a straight line? So it's one. Uh, two locations. So four more gold. So 28. The longest line you have is two locations. Mm -hmm. 25, 28. That's the worst one I've had so far. All right. Me. You rushed it, though, getting all those subdued guys right off the bat. Which yeah. I didn't, I didn't realize that me. the game yeah. ended when you got them. Okay, so then purple is uh, I you. have three stars. So three stars times four is 12. Uh, how many locations? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven times three is 21. So yeah. 21 plus, what was it? 12. 12. So that is 30, 33. 33. And then how many resources do you have? Two. So that's two more gold. 30. So 35. 35. And then where's your location? It's just, I don't know. So that's, that's a two gold. 20. So 37. Two gold. 25, 35, 36. 37. 37. Okay. Uh, we'll go meet. Yellow. Uh, let's go with, uh, what is it? Stars. Three times four is 12. Oh. Uh, locations I control one, two, three, four, five. That's fifteen. So that is twenty-seven. Plus resources one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So that's eight. That's four times two, is eight more. Thirty-five. Thirty-five. 35. And then locations I have two in a row. Uh, so another four. Thirty-nine. 39. Here I'll give you one for. It's the lowest two. Rob's ever gotten too. Well, well, we, we all ended really, the game ended early, so... I don't even have any stars. How funny is that? <laughs> One more turn would have got me stars, but... Okay, so, so Nick, zero, for uh, zero stars. Uh, territories you control. One. One. No. Two. One. Oh, one. oh three. Two, three, two. three. 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 Oh, four. Four. Four times three is 12. Uh, resources, you get two, two more. So that's 14. Yeah, and then buildings? locations, buildings, sorry, in a row. No. No. Uh, one, so that's two more. It's technically a straight line. It's one of the uh, one. Okay, so 13, 15? <laughs> Uh, 14. Wow, that's 14. brutal. I thought he had, th okay. I don't know. He had 12 he had for this. He had 5. Because he had 4. 12, 13, And then 14. he had another 2. So, so 15, 14. 14. Plus 2 more is 16. 16. 15 16. Yeah, we're all replacing. Brutal. Can't wait for the comments later where, like, how many times we messed up the math throughout all today. Oh There's probably tons. We're like, we you should have had one more. You should have had one less. You should have. Do we do everyone? Uh, yep, yeah, so let's add it up. So I'm sitting mm -hmm. at 47. Oh, 47. <laughs> What do you got, Nick? 10, 20, don't worry about me. 26, 29, 31. I also have 31. Jeez. Five, I can't that's a break five. Any of you. And a five is 10. Okay, 
Okay, so 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, uh, 60 64. 64, all right, Mel's got the wins. Yes. Put it on your sheet for episode four. And then add your money episode to your total. Four. That's brutal. So 47. I think it was a These bad one for all of us. something good. So well, Mel got the most. That doesn't mean that's... 56, 96 now. Okay. Okay. And then I was hoping because I also had the most of those guys. I told you this stupid good. one was the worst oh, one to pick. Okay. Ready? Outcomes. Yeah. Are you guys ready? I've never used it mm. yet. Yep. Yep. Okay. Uh, so, outcomes. Although governments were now paying handsomely for the capture or killing of Fenris agents, they have proven difficult targets. Not impossible by any means, but strong enough to be a nuisance. Still, nations gradually drove them back, and it began to look as though Fenris might be eliminated in their future. The, uh, the continued progress against Fenris helped the citizens relax and feel safer than they had in months. Vesna still remained cautious, but the nations of Europa felt confident in their success against the Fenris, Fenris threat. So record your victory. Done. Stars, uh, which I haven't oh, yeah. got to yet, and your coins on your campaign log. So stars. Objective again. Uh, meeple. And mech. Okay, and then for every two Fenris agents you subdued, round it up. Increase a setup bonus on your campaign log by one, observing the limits of popularity and power. So every two you've got? Yeah. Round it up. So yeah. you are just you just go up one, so put a one Mal in your spot. Two. Go up two. See, was that so worth it? Yeah. Yeah. I don't think so. Well, she won, so that was smart, I think. Of well, her. she stopped so, it fast. Yeah, because I knew that... But she still that, won. That was perfect. Like, yeah, because I perfect. knew that it was getting close. Uh, let's we'll start with... Let's do... Can I, I start know. with... One more popular bonus. Now, why do you get that? Let's do... Because I round up this. Oh, you had one. I didn't two. know you had one. Yeah, yeah. I, I was going to close it off, get the second one on the same yeah. turn. But I was like, no, I don't want to I thought for dick. sure you were going to do that. Because no, I, I knew I wasn't like set up to win. I thought you were ahead of me at that point, and she was probably ahead of me at that point. Uh, okay. Then add the mod tokens you did not unlock in episode 2A or B, either mech mods or infrastructure mods, from the punch board to mm. the general supply. Read the rules for that mod type, page 6 or 7, and make those tokens available. Interesting. So we get them so, anyways. Oh, boom. Yeah, that's interesting. Okay, so mech mods. I'm going to punch out a whole bunch of this crap. And then we're just going to get to do some more purchasing, I'm sure. So they're similar to what Ashley has already taken on Vesna that we've seen. You're missing one. I think this one though. <coughs> oh, I guess it's the same. Yeah, it's part of it. Okay, uh, so that's done. This one's empty. All right, so these mech mods. Let's get another lid of some kind or something. Crap. Yeah, they throw a under, lot. Under that scythe box is our dice tray. Maybe we can just use that for now. Okay, yep, that works. All right. So I'm assuming that's how they work. So I'll read while you, someone does that. Let's mm -hmm. find out mech mods, how they work. Which I'm assuming is the same kind of way that Ashley just did, but you get to purchase them and then choose from them each game. Uh, mech mods. Mech mods are persistent improvements that will, uh, will be unlocked at certain points in the campaign. These 41 tokens provide variable mech abilities that replace the abilities found on your faction mat. Purchasing mech mods, 50 each. 50 bucks each, same as the other ones, infrastructure mods. At the end of each episode, after adding any coins earned in that game, use your total wealth to purchase mods. Each player randomly draws two mech mods from the general supply and may buy them. Players all draw, then make their purchasing choices simultaneously. When drawing mech mods, discard any duplicates, same as the other ones, and draw replacements. You may only, if you have one of each mod, you may only have one of each mod, purchase any or all of the newly drawn mods at a cost of 50 each. You may choose not to buy either mod. Unpurchased mods are returned to the general supply. You're limited to six total mech mods, as indicated in your campaign log. Purchased mech mods carry over from game to game. Note uh, them on your campaign log. Unpurchased mech mods remain in the general supply. Remember, the purpose of your wealth is to buy mods, perks, etc. Your total wealth is, does not factor in winning the campaign. Using mech mods during setup, you may choose to replace mech abilities on your faction map with your mech mods. Set aside any extras. 
which may include all of your mods if you're not you're not required to use them certain mech mods have a symbol with an arrow crossed out that symbol we're running about to indicate they cannot be used against non-player units so we might face another faction that's controlled mm. by the computer kind of thing or an ai uh, after an episode begins you may not reorganize your mods for the current episode so you put them on the spots on your base and they stay on those spots you can't be like i'll move it over here and move it over there it just stays where it is and you can't switch uh, mech mod clarifications we'll read those if we need to and that is that there's just more things to choose from so we have to go back to finish uh yes we do uh was that episode four, four. All right, add the mods you do not unlock from the punch board and just probably read the rules for that. Make those tokens available. Following the standard mod rules, each player draws two of each mod type, four tokens total from the supply and may purchase them $50 each. As a bonus, the game winner draws plus one of either mod type for a total of five mods to choose from. Okay. Nothing for free, right? We're paying for uh, everything. So these ones are Nothing here. And these ones are here. So, whatever. You have to choose random? Or oh, you do the same thing. Draw two of each type. Each type. Uh, just make sure they're different. <clears throat> And make sure they're not the same as what you already have. Okay, so mine are different. Oops, oh, uh, pick two. But you can pick a third of one of these two types. Yeah, I'm going to pick three of these, and I'll tell you if I need to change any of them. Yeah, well, I'll leave this here, and you can just drop them back in and grab new ones. So these are good. Uh, what do I have? Did you do these? So I passed for mine. I have. Just being a gentleman. Because they were right here. Oh, None of mine are good. matching. I'm good. Oh. And did you get two of these, Nick? Nope. Just make sure they're different than each other. Good. Okay. Each one of these costs 50, even if I say I wanted one of these. Yeah, Every one of these. So these. if you pay 200, you can get all four you have in your hand. Okay, don't want that one okay. for sure. Let's see. So I will drop 50 down to 46. Purchase. I'm going to pay, pay one full hundred, going down to $2. Oh, so you're not going to be able to do the perks next That's time. That's fine. And I'm going to buy those two. I think those are better suited, and those are going back to the pool. These are what I'm buying. So I have two dollars left over. Yes. Maybe I should have kept going a little bit longer to get some more money. I know. That's what I was thinking. I was like, I just need, <laughs> we need more money to blow up, buy stuff. I'm not gonna take any of these, but one of these explain one of that one that we didn't know better. Oh, okay. It actually oh. explains the whole thing. I think I just saw it actually. Uh, <laughs> Probably. Those are mine. And I looked at it and I was like, oh, it's the same as I already read on yours. But it, the wording's different. Yes, but it it's is. The exact it's a typo same. on the other one. Before you, before combat, you may be too powered to play plus one combat card. Yes. It's a hundred. It's just a typo on the other one for okay. sure. It's, that's all it is. That's what I thought. I'm like, it doesn't explain the whole ability in English. And it's like trying to tell you with an image, which they usually just duplicate. So yeah. Then... So you're good. Are you good? Yep. yep. Yeah. All right, so what I purchased... Is it all good? You're all done? Uh, what I purchased was assembly line, deploy, reduce the cost of one deploy action to zero metal. Nice. So it's just like this, another one of those discounts. I got the same one. Okay. What did you get, Ash? What did I you didn't buy? take anything. Nothing new? So I bought armor for the mech ones, and before combat, an attacking opponent must discard one combat card. You gain that much power. Awesome. Oh, wow. So that's that. And then that's a good one. auto machine, so produce double the production. Yeah, yeah. Double the production. Guys yeah I would have bought both of those, too. Yeah, they're so good. Okay. Uh, you get one for free? Or that's 100 bucks? No, that's 100 bucks. I have $2 left. Yeah, he, he, she just wow. got to look at five total tokens yeah. instead of four like we did. Yeah. Uh, and that was the episode rewards, and then they would be on to episode five. That was cool. So oh, that's wow. going to end it there. Or is um, it? No, it, it is. is. <laughs> what? He said or is. Or is it? Yeah. Are you guys going to stay for the fifth game of Scythe in a row? Oh, my God. We've been going on 10 hours and 36 minutes so far of streaming. Uh, this is crazy. Awesome New Year's Day. Great way to kick off 2020. If you've been watching this live with us at any point during the day, thank you for being here. If you don't want to miss it live, you're watching this in the future, make sure you subscribe, hit that notification bell so you don't miss when we go live like this new crazy, long, super awesome live streams. Uh, also, follow us on social media down in the links below so you do not miss when we go live. But we're going to end it here for episode four of this. Uh, and stay tuned. Episode five, six, seven, and eight will come eventually. <laughs> but there may be some time between that because these guys are disappearing going on a vacation. We want to kind of keep playing with the same players, but we might add in extra players if someone else is available to play with us on that day. Thank you for following along with us. Thank you to all our Patreon backers for supporting the channel. 
you appreciate it so much. If you'd like to donate, links are in the description below. Uh, if you have any rules, goofs, comments, questions, anything, leave it down below in the comments. We'll read that stuff later. Um, and that's about it. Thanks a lot for watching. Have a good night. See you in the next one. Bye-bye.